Confetti Club, it is Pixie, and we are here today for a shoe unboxing! I ordered two pairs of shoes from YRU. I ordered them from their actual YRU store this time and not Dolls Kill or Zuji or anything. Is this hot pink pillow distracting? Yes. And I got them in a big box. Ooh, that was a concerning noise. I mentioned this before, but I just got a job at Claire's Accessories, so I'm now working Claire's and Freak and YouTube. So I have two jobs, and at Claire's, we can't wear sneakers, which is totally fair, because you have to look cool. Um, but at my other job at Freak, I've become, like, much more <laughs> leaning towards being comfy in some sneaks then looking cute which is crazy for me because usually i'm like chop off my arms it doesn't matter as long as it is bougie however um now i have to look cute and comfortable so i ordered some shoes also they were on sale so double whammy also um yes my roots are visible and like not good I don't really care, I kind of like how roots look, I don't know if that's weird, I feel like it's like low-key kind of a trend, but um, you are very welcome because I've just been so gracious just now, letting you know that I'm aware, so now you don't have to comment it, I just, I'm really in the spirit of giving <laughs> this season, so you know, I just, you're welcome that I did that for you. <laughs> okay i'm sorry that was that was sassy i'm not sorry actually whatever all right i'm just gonna open these the heck up they came pretty quick i did get them from the sale thing i saved like a butt ton of money because it was already on sale and then they were having it uh take 20 percent off of whatever even if it's already on sale so i was like thank you and they did mark down the value on the box which is cool because then you get charged um less customs or duty uh i don't think i was charged any duty which is cool yeah it says um it says value 47.50 i think i paid around 80 us 120 or something canadian um i will put how much i saved slash how the money worked around here Boop -a -doop -boop 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 -boop. Also, yeah, since they were on sale, it did say, like, there's no exchanges, final sale, and also the packaging varies or something, which is funny. Just meaning, like, it's on sale, these are our odds and ends, you're getting whatever box we have on hand, so... I'm so happy with my box selection. So I have a straight up, definitely banged up YRU box and a cute to the core box. <laughs> Fuck, okay. Um, I'm gonna go with the, my bra straps are driving me crazy. I'm gonna go with the bigger one because I think that's the more exciting one. So I got these shoes with work and Japan in mind because when my mom and I were at Halcon, see my Halcon vlog a couple videos back, please watch it. Um, we realized that our feet were exploding, like could not walk anymore, pain after a day. And that's a problem because we're gonna be in Japan for like 10 days to 14 days and we need to have feet. So, I got some mega, hopefully mega comfy shoesies. And these are the bomb shoes. In pink, obviously. Oh, I'm so excited! Da 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 Oh, they look so nice. These are the shoes. My feet are a size 8. I got a size 8. I had the Why Are You Night calls that I got um, when I did that collab with Zuji. And those were size 8, but they were kind of small on me. But I'm usually a size 8, and these look clunky and big anyway, so I got a size 8. Boop, boop, boop. Yeah, so these are like a sneaker, sort of. Do, can I call this a sneaker? We're allowed to wear sneakers as long as they're like fashionable and cool and like not like the ones I wear all the time that are super beat up. But, we And yeah, he does have a significant platform, which is good and I like it. Um, But it just, it's like a flat form almost, so it looks like it'll be comfortable enough. It has this rose and stud 
2013 pastel goth thing which I'll probably take off and leave off and just have it as this maybe I don't know if I like that or not or if that's dumb I kind of like it may oh you know what I'll probably do I'll probably replace it with like an iridescent sequin band I'll replace it with something else more me because I, I like the idea but I'm not a fan of the like this is more me like four years ago and this is like me now yeah I really like the laces they're like big satiny ribbons I love that because you've got like a hard looking like if these were brown they'd be like work boots work shoes whatever but then you get like the satiny and the flowers mm -wee. yeah I really like these I hope they fit and also on the inside can you see that probably not it has the embroidered why are you logo which is always nice. I love it when brands like embroider their logo onto stuff. I'm like, good, that's important, you're important, do it. <laughs> Time for our cute to the core box. <laughs> this is so funny. Oh, cute to the core. Oh my lord, what are you guys doing? Um, yes, this box is very misleading because I even got the freaking wrapping paper. Unless, no, I don't think so. Oh, these are so cute. This style, these shoes are just called pom-pom. So, oh. Okay, I'm not a huge, oh, these are cute to the core. Okay, the box is correct, actually. I take it all back, I'm sorry. I knew I ordered pink pom-pom shoes, so I was like not expecting that kind of fun. I was never a huge fan of this sort of like loafery, Tomsy, Vamsy style shoe, but I am a big fan of pom poms and metallic. And so I was like, okay, they look comfy as hell. They look cute as hell. And I feel like these will be like a pretty good go-to. I love the big pom pom. I hope it doesn't get dirty. These were on super sale. I think these ended up being like 20 bucks or something. C -c -c crazy. And yeah, they look like that. These are both of the pairs of shoes that I bought. I like them so much. I hope they fit. I'm gonna try them on and give you guys a cheeky walkabout if you wanna see what they look like on my feet. I'm not sure why you would need to see that, but I will supply it to you. I got you back. So this is what they look like on my feet. They fit pretty well. They're actually a little bit big which is weird because the night calls were like so definitely on the small side but that's okay because it's way easier to just um put an insole in or a cheater in to the backs of these bad boys than to like literally just shove your foot into a small shoe so yeah these are awesome and I feel super duper stable like I am ready to hike up a mountain these are also a little bit big what the heck I'm definitely an eight in most shoes I usually wear, but I guess maybe why are you usually tends to run a little big, but I love these. They're very cute. You can see there's definitely room around the heel, but once again, I'll just stick an insole or a cheater in there. Does anyone else call them cheaters or is that just like a Canada thing? But yeah, these feel like they're going to be ridiculously comfortable. I might low key live in these in Japan. I'm not sure if you're supposed to wear socks with this kind of shoe, <laughs> um, but my socks have strawberries on them. Aren't they cute? Aren't they cute? But yeah, these are the pom-pom shoes. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. If you want to check out Why Are You, I really love their stuff. They have some of my favorite shoes. I really want the Why Are You gem shoes. Those have been on my freaking mind for like at least a year but every time i'm like jillian and yeah i just think they're a fantastic brand and now i have three pairs of shoes from them which is nice hmm. today's featured confetti club member is mahal hime haruka she's so cute here she is in her internet princess shirt with her cheeky confetti club shirt in the background i love that and i love your makeup and hair you're so freaking cute what are you doing 
Also, if your username is a reference to Go Princess Pretty Here, then we are the same person. Indeed. Once again, if you want to be a featured Confetti Club member, just send me a pic of you in your sweet Pixie Threads merch. The link will be in the description, and you can just tag me on Instagram. It's usually the best way to get it in front of my eyeballs. Alright, you guys, I love you so, so much, and I'll see you in the next video, which is not this one, because this one is over. 